guys welcome to my channel it's your girl mama guy again and i'm in with another video this tutorial is a round beaded handle a very interesting one of that so if it is something you are interested stay tuned please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel for more videos to all my returning subscribers thank you very much for coming back and to all my new subscribers welcome to the family let's go Welcome. So this is what we are coming to recreate. This is how it looks. Yes. Yeah, so my hand can go inside. So this is how it looks. A very strong one. Now the materials needed. This is my sugar bead, my sugar bead, my fish line, and a scissors to cut my line. So now cut a fish line that will be okay for you. Pick four beads. Add it to any side of the fish line. Add it to any side of the fish line. Hold the third, the fourth one rather, and cross the other fish line through like this. Hold the two ends together and pull it. If you hold the two ends, it makes the fish line equal. So now we continue by holding the two ends of the fish line again. Pick three beads. Pick three beads. Add one to the right side one to the left side and the third bead we are going to cross both the fish line through the third bead like this hold the two end of your fish line and pull it that's the process we are going to use in step one yeah so we hold the two end of our fish line together pick three beads add one to the left side one to the right side and the third bead we are going to cross both the fish line through the third bead like this hold the two end of your fish line and pull it yeah, so this is how it looks so we repeat this process 19 times we are going to repeat this process 19 times so let's repeat it one again pick three beads add one to the right side one to the left side and the third one cross both the fish line through the third bead like this hold the two end of your fish line and pull it yes yeah, so this is how it's looking so we are going to repeat the same process 19 times yes yeah, so this is my 19th step here and this is how it looks it depends on the size that you are looking for so now let's count to see if we are on the right side yes yeah, so now on this fish line over here which is the left fish line add all your three bits on the left fish line so this is the 20th step that we are doing the 20th step so cross your fish line inside the third bit so this is how it looks instead of my fish line to be here it's now here so we are turning to this side on the left fish line again add all your three beads on the left fish line hold the third one use the other side of the fish line to cross inside the third bead like this and pull your fish line so now pass the right fish line through the next bead over here pass the right fish line through the next bead and on the left fish line add two beads add two beads hold the second one and use the right fish line to cross inside and pull it repeat the same process again by passing the right fish line through the next bead over here pass it through the next bead over here and on this fish line over here which is the left fish line add two beads add two beads hold the second one and use the right fish line to cross inside and pull it so that's what we are going to repeat again so we finish this round pass the right fish line through the next bead and on the left fish line add two beads hold the second one and use the right fish line to cross inside and pull it yes so this is how it's looking this is how it's looking we repeat the same process again so we finish this round that's what we are going to do hold the second bead and cross it inside and pull it so this is how it looks so we are going to repeat the same process so we reach 
the end of this round here so now pass the right fish line through the next bead over here and on the same fish line that you pass through the next bead yes i flip it to make it easy for me so on this same fish line over here which is the right fish line now add all your two beads the same fish line that we pass through the bead add your two beads and cross the fish line through that the second bead so now uh, my fish line is in this bead instead of the top bead over here so this is how it looks this is how flat it is this side is now 20 this side is now 20 and this side is 2 this side is 2 and this side is 20 so we are going to fold it like this fold it in V form fold it in V form like this like this so now this is how it looks it's now yes yeah, so this is how it looks so we are going to cover the top over here we are going to cover the top over here so on the left fish line add one bead on the left fish line like this and pass it to the next side bead over here the next bead over here like this so now this is how it looks this is how it looks our fish line is in both sides so we are going to add one bead again like this and cross both fish line through that one bead again like this and pull it so this is how it's looking so the right fish line pass it to the next bead the left fish line also through the next bead like this and this one also through the next bead over here like this and add one bead add one bead cross both fish line through that one bead like this so we are going to continue the same process by passing the right fish line through the right bead the right side bead and the left fish line also through the left side bead like this and we are going to add one bead you cross the boat fish line through that one bead like this and pull it so remember to pull very well to have a strong handle pull very well to have a strong handle pass the right fish line through the right side bead the left fish line also through the left side bead and add one bead yes we are going to add one bead and cross the boat fish line through that one bead and pull it so that's the process we are repeating on this stage to cover the top here yes we are going to cover the top here pass the right fish line through the right side bead like this and the left fish line also through the left side bead like this and add one bead cross the fish line through and pull it so this is the process we are going to repeat so we reach the end side here so this is how it looks yes you can see that it's very strong so we are going to join the two ends together like this to make it round and firm like this so now let's join it together yes, so now you can see that the end here is having three beads and the other side is also having three beads so cut a new fish line and pass it through this bead over here like this so on the middle fish line which is the right fish line add one bead add one bead and join it together to pass it through the same bead on the other side this bead on the other side like this yes yeah, so this is how it looks this is how it looks so now we are going to add one bead again cross both fish line through that one bead and pull it yes yeah, so this is how it's looking so here what we are going to do is to pass the fish line through the next beads sorry that it's not showing well but pass your right fish line through the next bead the left fish line also through the next bead and add one bead like this 
so we are going to repeat the same process at the last end over here at the last end over here and pass your fish line through the baits and tie it so that is how it looks we repeat the same process over here by passing the right fish line through the right side bead the left fish line also through the left side bead and add one bead add one bead and cross both fish line through that one bead and pull it pull it very well so what i'm going to do next is to pass the fish line through the bait pass the fish line through the bait pass it through the bait over and over again make a knot and pass it through again so that's what i am doing here i'm passing my fish line through the bait so here i'm making a knot make a strong knot over here make a no another knot again make another knot again and pass it through your beads to make it strong if you follow me to this stage thank you very very much for the patience and the love please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel for more videos to all my returning subscribers thank you very much for coming back and to all my new subscribers subscribing right now into my channel thank you for joining this beautiful family okay so this is our end result that we just made this is how beautiful it looks a round beaded handle so this is it yes so see you next time bye bye